Hey YouTube, this is Denise, um, aka the Hannah Three. Um, I just want to talk a little bit today about hair, black people's hair. Um, the reason for doing that is that um, I've been thinking a lot about hair lately. Um, I've been watching some videos on YouTube about natural hair, um, and as well as relaxed hair and texturized hair, silken silkeners sometimes they call it. Um, and I just want to do a video of what I'm thinking right now. Um, I spoke, to, well, let me go back a little further. Um, some months ago, actually over a year ago, um, I braided my hair for the first time. I did some twists and everything like that. Before, I never did braids. I don't know, I just never, I never went around to doing it because people were always telling me it's going to damage my hair. In that, um, you know, at that time I had pretty, you know, an okay length and everything like that. People were like always saying that it's gonna damage my hair and that, you know, my hairline is gonna go missing. So I always was, I was always so scared to get braids. So I just said, you know what, let me try something, but I won't keep it in too long and I won't um, wear it too tight because so I hate a uh, losing hairline. I hate the whole look of <laughs> uh, losing your hairline and stuff like that. But um, so I did that and uh, when I took my braids out. Um, cause I did it actually two times, and I had it, in, I guess, for, like, all together, I had it in about uh, three and a half, three months, three to four months, um, and my hair was braided, and um, it had um, growth, because before I put the braids in, it was already growing, it was about time to get a perm, technically, and so um, it was already growing out for a bit, and um, it was about this much or so natural hair there, so I was, like, thinking, hmm, should I go natural, because I see all these wonderful styles of, you know, people who are doing natural hairstyles and how, you know, it's kind of liberating because you don't have to worry about putting the chemicals in your hair, you don't have to worry about, oh my gosh, my hair is really kinky or curly or nappy or whatever terminology you want to use at the roots and then the ends are straight and you don't want the, end, the hair at the ends to break and all that stuff and uh, I didn't know what to do, so I was like thinking, should I just go natural and I was like thinking, hmm how would I look, because I guess the last time I was natural was when I was in uh, junior high, and at that time, I guess, natural hair wasn't in, or whatever, it was just nappy, or whatever the terminology was um, back then, and, it, you know, it was unmanageable, and all those different things, and so, um, instead of going natural, I did something, I guess, in between perm and in between um, going natural, which is uh, texturizing, and um, I've been I've been enjoying it. So right now, uh, pretty much my hair is texturized. When I went, I just got it um, uh, redone, the roots redone, like uh, two weeks ago. And so the hair she did a pretty good cut. I actually did cut. She kind of did a chop because I did have a lot of straight ends already. And so she told me pretty much maybe about this much hair was left. Maybe this much of my hair was left um, as perm. And all the back was all um, texturized now, so um, I watched it uh, a few days ago, two days ago, and when I did watch it, everything else was curly except for a few ends around the sides and all that stuff, but the back was all, you know, that whole wavy thing when you uh, texturize. So right now I'm enjoying it, um, but watching the videos of natural hair has been making me want to say, hmm, should I start to transition into going natural, and I don't know, I, uh, right now I'm just thinking, I don't know if I could do it, so um, I'm wondering if it's just the whole mindset that we were, you know, taught in regards to um, wearing our hair straight, straight is beautiful, and all those different things, I think it's probably something to do with that, because even my hairdresser that I go to to get my hair texturized now, um, she's always saying, Denise, why don't you wear your, do your wash and wear look, and I was like, oh, I'm not ready yet. Um, my hair is still straight at the ends, and I don't know if it's going to look good on me, but I do want to do it, but, and, you know, I keep on giving her excuses, but, like, the whole point of me texturizing it is because I wanted to do the whole wash and wear look. I wanted some freedom with my hair and not having to always uh, blow dry and flat iron it every time I washed it and everything like that, but I still have a little bit of, um, uh, apprehension in wearing my hair curly. I like the whole curly thing, but I guess I've always had my hair mostly straight and everything like that so I'm just wondering can I pull it off? Well, I think I could pull it off but I guess it's just the whole thing of going and actually doing it so that's the thing um, but yeah it's just 
you know, thought, you know, it's just really hard and difficult, you know, as a black person, um, uh, having to deal with people, you know, I guess the, the um, ideals of what our hair should look like, and if your hair is not straight, it's, you know, it's nappy, and they put a word, you know, the, the, make the word nappy sound so horrible and everything like that, and, oh, your hair is too nappy, this and that, so I guess it puts that pressure on you to always conform, and so I think um, I'm going to start wearing my hair curly soon. <laughs> I think I'm going to, at least I'm going to try it out, so I think I'm going to I use a couple of products that um, a coworker of mine uh, told me about. Um, she has natural hair. She went through the whole process of being perm, having her hair perm, relaxed, then going natural, then going to texturizer, then going back to natural. And so right now she's natural. So she gave me a product by um, Miss Jessie's, and um, it's called Stretch and Softening Cream. Yeah. I guess it's kind of advertising for Miss Jessie's, but it's. Uh, called Stretch and Silken and Cream. There you go. By Miss Jessie. And um, I think I'm going to try it. I think I'm going to try it. I know um, even like lately my mom was like, because um, when I went, came from here, she did a pretty big cut because I know it's a transition of getting the straight hair cut off. And for that she's like, oh, it's too short. And I don't know. Some people think my hair is most people think my hair is pretty good length, but um, it was longer because she probably cut about maybe this much off of everything and everything like that. But it was, but yeah, it it got cut, but it still looks pretty. I think it looks pretty good. But anyways, um, my point was, um, I think I want to start trying to go to curly look. My mom always says, "Oh, straight hair looks good on you," and even right now, my hair is pretty. I think it's pretty straight, but um, she was like saying, "Oh, it's." It's this curl at the ends. I'm like, no, no, it's straight, it's straight. And she's, so she's, that's my hair. Straight, straight. And everything like that. But I think I'm going to try um, to do the wash and wear look and to, you know, um, I guess kind of celebrate some of my natural curls. I know that when you get texturized, it's kind of like not, not it's not natural anymore, but the curls are more loosened. So I'm going to start trying to see how that works for me. And I'm probably going to make a video <laughs> not too long after I do that to, um, to see how it, how it goes and how I'm liking it. Um, yeah, that's all I wanted to say. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching my video and stay tuned for more videos. Bye.